welcome to our channel. My name is Regina. I'm the Hoya lady here at Gardena Nursery. Uh, I love Hoyas. They are very easy to grow and they have beautiful flowers. Most of the flowers, the Hoyas flowers are fragrant. And uh, also some Hoyas, they have just spectacular leaves. They are big, they have veins, they have colors, and uh, so very pretty. Today I'm going to focus on Gardena Nursery hybrids. We have sev seven hybrids here. Uh, our first one is Hoya Paula. It's my favorite one. It's, it grows super fast, like you see here. It's a lush plant. And uh, the flowers, it's just adorable. And it's fragrant. And uh, Hoya Paula, it's a cross between Hoya Pochilii and Hoya Albida. The two next ones uh, came from the same seed pod. It's Hoya Andrea and Hoya Eric. Um, I selected Hoya Andrea because it uh, has this beautiful leaf, like oval leaf. And um, the cross between those two are uh, Hoya Celata and Hoya Dazianta. Um, both they have uh, fuzzy flowers and uh, very fragrant too. Hoya uh, Andrea has, uh, this is from another clone, but it's very similar. Has uh, like uh, flowers like this, and it has some uh, little bit of a uh, pink on the flowers. Uh, Hoya Eric, it's more like lighter, you see, but both they have a, a pink center, and it's very fragrant. I selected a uh, Hoya Eric because it has more like uh, elongated leaves, and um, resembles more like a Hoya Celata. And uh, as you can see, Hoya Eric, more long, and this is uh, Andre, it's more oval. Okay, uh, the next two ones also came from the same seed pot. I select Hoya Regina because of the huge leaves. Um, is when I saw the first time when it was growing, I said, oh my gosh, this is beautiful. Uh, and the, then I get Roya Reg Hoya Regina and uh, also Hoya Seed from the same seed pot. Um, uh, the cross is between Hoya species Kochang Island and Hoya Elliptica. Uh, both they have uh, flowers like similar to Hoya uh, as, uh, species, Kochang Island, and it's super fragrant. Uh, Hoya uh, seed, I select the second seedling because it had some uh, veins like a uh, Hoya elliptica. I don't know if you can see here, but you know, sometimes it's very clear to see. The next one, it's a uh, Florida beauty, um, and it's, um, it's a cross uh, between Hoya doliscoparte and Hoya pacricada. Um, as you can see, uh, the leaves are more like a Hoya uh, pacricada, you know, resembles Hoya pacricada. It's thick and uh, round, and the flower is very pretty and pr fragrant. And uh, it's more like similar to Hoya doliscoparte. This is the last one, it's Hoya Valentina, and it's a cross between Hoya pubicalix, red button, and Hoya carnosa. The flower, it's uh, white and fuzz. Today I just have the buds, but it's uh, pretty much like Hoya carnosa. Uh, it smells like chocolate, and uh, the center it's red, but the corona, it's light yellow. As the flower, get um, older, uh, the color gets uh, more intense. So it's going to be more like a yellow uh, corona color. Uh, the leaves, 
are pretty much like um, carnosa, a little bit a mix of a, a Hoya pubicalis red button. It's a strong plant. It grows super fast and uh, tons of uh, uh, flowers. And I think that's it for today. Thank you very much. And I see you next time.